Hello students, welcome. Dear students, today in our circus chapter, we are going to solve problem set number 29 and problem set number 30. Both are very easy. Let's start with problem set number 29. The first example is, if the radius of a circle is 7 cm, here radius is given, what will its diameter? We have to find the diameter. Now we know. Uh, the diameter of a circle is twice the length of radius okay so these all things i gave in the uh, note students you have to read the notes what is called diameter radius and the relation between the diameter and uh, diameter and radius also given see again uh, we will revise now for example this is radius and this is diameter so diameter is double then radius okay means radius is half of diameter and radius two times radius is equal to diameter now see the formula here diameter is equal to two multiplied by radius twice double so two multiplied by radius simple thing so here student diameter we have to find so two into radius is given seven centimeter seven to the 40 centimeter this way you have to uh, solve first write the formula always now students these examples are not from the textbook these numbers here i change the numbers but the examples are similar from the textbook so these example also you have to write and you have, and the, whatever the given examples in problem set number 29 the numbers that also you have to solve for homework and these also write in the notebook as a classroom now we have second one if the diameter of a circle is 12 now here diameter is given we have to find the radius what will its radius simple thing we know diameter is given see the formula is here radius is equal to diameter divided by 2 so diameter is 12 centimeter divided by 2 so uh, two, uh, 12 divided by 2 2 6 uh, 12 so radius is 6 cm you understood i hope this is very simple <coughs> again diameter of a circle is twice the length of radius means double radius is equal to diameter and if we have to find the uh, means here uh, what what we have to find here if the diameter is given and we have to find the radius in divided by 2 if uh, we have to find the diameter so 2 multiplied by radius and if we find the radius then diameter divided by 2 keep these two formulas in your head now the third question complete the following table by filling in the blanks so we have to fill in the blanks simple thing radius double now these numbers also are different students that is not from textbook so along with this you have to write the question number 3 whatever given in the problem set in textbook so here 6 we have to here we have to, we have, we have to find the diameter so twice double 6 to the 12 now again we will solve the radius example then we will move to the diameter and here 10 twice double 10 to the double 10 to the this 20 centimeter now here student diameter is given we have to find the radius diameter means here we divide means half of we have to find the radius so uh, radius is half of diameter see here radius is equal to diameter divided by 2 so 28 if your tables are very good so you can write easily otherwise do the division simple thing okay write tables every day okay 2 to 30 one time now and i will check that when school get reopened that time i will check the table notebook also now 28 2 za 28 28 half okay so 14 2 za so half of 28 is 14 now here 30 which 30 means what, what number 2 is a 30 or half of 30 that is 
15 सेंटीमीटर 15 2 जा 30 14 2 जा 20 सो हियर हाफ यू आर टू राइट आई होप यू अंडरस्टूड दिस सिंपल थिंग हियर दिस फार्मूलास यू हैव टू से आई सॉल्व दिस नाउ वी विल मूव टू द प्रॉब्लम सेट नंबर 30 दिस इज अ लिटिल बिट डिफरेंट बट वेरी सिंपल नाउ व्हाट इज व्हाट वी हैव टू फाइंड इन द टेबल बिलो सो आई नॉट ड्रॉ द टेबल I just write here because I have to explain you. That's why I wrote here. But while solving the examples, you have to draw the table, students. Uh, same that is given in this problem set number 30. Now, uh, write the names of the points in the interior and exterior of the circle and those on the circle. Very simple. Here, students, uh, you can say this is circle some points on the circle the blue color green color you can see these are outside of the circle means exterior points outside of the circle exterior point and some are inside so that we got uh, interior points very simple uh, the green color exterior and black color interior point now those who are inside interior of the circle that will write first points in the interior so write first any a d and o is the center of the circle that also will write because it is inside the circle interior of the circle and n then points in the exterior outside circle so write m p m p t J R. Now points on the circle. Here these points on the circle. Y W X Z. Y W X Z. You can change the sequence also. You can write Z X W Y also. Isn't it? So that is not necessary. So we have to anyhow you have to write, but count properly and then you have to write points in the interior points in the exterior and points on the circle these points also students these are not from the textbook so this example also you have to write and uh, the example given in textbook also you have to write i hope you understood student now one more thing i have to tell you uh, one more practice set remain just reminding you after problem set number 30 over in the next video we will solve problem set number 31 your syllabus is over I means so your portion for first term is up to the circle okay next video will be the last video for first term isn't it okay students still there take care bye bye